welcome back to my channel. So I am grocery shopping for the month of July right now, even though I, there's still four days left in June. It's just the last four meals that I have all require a lot of mozzarella cheese and I don't have any. So I might as well just get all the groceries at once instead of just getting cheese and then going back four days later to get everything else. So I'm going to Aldi's, Walmart, and Wegmans again. But I'm doing Walmart grocery pickup, so hopefully that works out. I've never done that before, and I clicked the box that says I do not want substitutes because I'm specific about what kind of food that I want or what flavors or what brand. So hopefully that doesn't mess it up in the end. So we'll see. But this is what I got for... July. <laughs> All right, Wegmans with the jelly. Okay, so I got six jelly again, and then I remembered I didn't add soy sauce to my Walmart haul, and then I didn't add. I'm not going to risk it with all these. I can't trust all these to have everything. So I just got applesauce because I'm going to make this muffin oatmeal thing situation that includes applesauce. So. so much bread. Okay, I underestimated all these. They do have applesauce. <laughs> and then these two. Cutie baby! Part of our budget, yeah. but all these has cute things. Mom, Mom, and... Mom, I want that shit. Okay, got sucked in. Locked and loaded over here. All right, so this is what we really got. Four milks, one almond milk, three chicken broths. We got two bags of pears, cabbage, lemon, six pounds of butter, celery, two of these things of bananas, limes, two grapes, apples, red potatoes, baked potatoes. We got this chocolate because uh, supposedly dark chocolate is healthier. And so, I don't know. We're going to see, see what it tastes yeah. like. Baking powder. Oh, wow. A jelly tower. <laughs> and we don't let it spill. Please don't let it spill. And more egg noodles for chicken noodle soup. So my husband's going to take this to work as like a snack because sometimes he doesn't pack enough lunch, so we need like a backup plan. We got 12 loaves of bread. Cereal. Uh Jelly. Six jellies, thank you. This jelly, applesauce, and soy sauce is from Wegmans. Uh, two granola bars, three bags of pretzels. What is this? Two boxes of penne, gummy snacks, ricotta cheese, four pounds of spaghetti, three bags of chips, two boxes of garlic bread. There's another box of cereal, bag of chips, and I got two pounds of Yes, you can color it. Skirt steak? I think that's what you're supposed to have for carne asada. I don't really remember, but I wrote, I just grabbed it. Two boxes of saltines and then 24 large tortillas for when we have burrito day. I did spend $31.96 at Wegmans and $168.67 at Aldi's. <laughs> 
<laughs> we finally own a deep freezer. It's just like a cute little thing because, you know, I don't need a big one, but we finally bought one. I've had friends tell me over and over, you need a deep freezer. Why don't you have a deep freezer or a second fridge or something? So we got this from Best Buy. So far, so good. Okay, so I brought Penelope and Mila with me to do my Walmart grocery pickup, but they fell asleep. Just kidding, Penelope woke up. But now we're waiting for the groceries to get loaded. I just opened the trunk, I don't know, and just wait. I checked in on the app, so. We're just waiting for all our groceries. And they didn't have 10 pound bags of chicken breasts. So I guess I have to come back and get that, which is fine because I have so much, so many other items that we're getting that I'll just come back tomorrow because I am so tired. I woke up at 5.20 this morning. Oh my gosh, so yeah. It's only now I realized I bought two boxes of diapers on accident. It's so cool. So I made some mistakes with my first Walmart uh, grocery pickup. I wasn't paying, first of all, I picked the wrong store. I was searching a store in Michigan, so that was a huge confusion. And then I finally fixed it to my area, and so I didn't, I'll show you. So I got, a bunch of petite diced tomatoes because they didn't have eight cans, so I just got two big ones. Chickpeas. This is what we use for pizza sauce. I'll kind of have to show you that. If you follow Jennifer Garner on Instagram, she does a pretend cooking show, and it's hysterical, but that's where I learned how to use whole peeled San Marzano tomatoes as pizza sauce, and it's really simple and easy and good. This is pork chops. I didn't get enough of. It's supposed to be two pounds. It's obviously not two pounds. This is meat for beef stew. I got a 20 pound bag of rice. I got a whole bunch of popsicles for my husband because we discovered these popsicles in Hawaii but lo and behold they are everywhere in Walmart. So now we got those. Two five pound bags of mozzarella cheese because all the meals I have left for July just need mozzarella cheese. This is five pounds of ground beef, two things of syrup. I didn't realize how big this coffee was, so that was like a purchase fail. I wanted to get like a small one because, you know, I'm in a tiny kitchen. This is not going to fit anywhere. Oh, if it's there. Okay. Problem solved. <laughs> coffee creamer. Three 60 count eggs. Another purchase fail is I got two boxes of diapers when I only wanted one, but that's probably because I picked the wrong store and I got confused again. Mac and cheese, so more popsicles for the girls. Uh, hamburger buns, frozen ravioli. What is this? Barbecue sauce, a bunch of these bags so I can freeze things. More pizza dough, a whole bunch of spaghetti sauce, ranch seasoning, and yogurt. Oh. Oh my gosh, and all these tortillas that I didn't know were here until just now. But anyway, so Walmart has corn tortillas again. So that's what we got. I still forgot to figure out how much all this was. So I have to minus diapers to figure out what it should have been. But I'll tell you the real total because I'm bummed I got two boxes of diapers. I don't need two boxes of diapers. But Walmart's too far for me to want to return it. But I kind of have to go tomorrow. I might return. Stay tuned. <laughs> but anyways, so this is what we got for our 31 meals in July. And then we still have four more meals in June. So that's what all that cheese is for. So it should, we should be good to go. I'm going to go fill my freezer, my new deep freezer, and fill up our kitchen cabinets. Thanks for watching.